This is the AT&T uh, 4920 Wi-Fi extender. I use this around my house. I actually have two of them. There's one right here right now that I use with my computers right there and I also use it with my ATEM Mini. I'm actually using this through uh, internet cable right there. So it's almost like a wireless, internet wireless wired internet cable connection right there. So you can bring this basically to any room. So I have this in this small room here where my Wi-Fi doesn't work strong enough here sometimes on my computer and I plug in my internet cable. At the back here you have two, two areas here. You can connect two different devices here directly to um, any other device that you have, your laptop or whatever it is. I'll basically walk you through the process of connecting these. You can get these from AT&T. You might get this for free or you might have to buy it. They also have a smart home manager app that you can use. And this will actually scan your house and tell you where you have weak spots. And you can kind of just get in contact with AT&T and see if you can get this for free first or they might give it to you at a discount. But let's go ahead and connect this one here. I already have this one connected on, on 2G and 5G and we'll work this out. So here we go, we have the router box right now. We're gonna plug in the extender. A few minutes, it's gonna take a while to, it's gonna pull, it should pull up right now. So we're gonna wait for that. So the power is on right now. We're gonna go into our on our router and we got WPS button right there. There's a button right there. You're gonna press and hold it down and it should turn green and start blinking. We're gonna press our WS, WPS button right there and put them close together. So here we go. Um, both device, both lights on the extender is now solid green on both the 5G and the 2.4G. So it's a matter of putting it right next to each other and just let it sit there for a while. It might take a while before it sync together, but this is basically it right now. You're now connected and you're basically ready to go. You can take this and move this to any location that you want, any room in the house that you have low Wi-Fi signal. And you can also, you can connect this to your internet I'm using, you can use internet cable to connect directly to your computer or anything anywhere. So you basically have like a, a wireless box that you can bring to different locations and plug this directly into your computer. So that's it. In case you want to reset, there's a, there's a little area at the back, you can just press, um, use a pin to reset this and do the process all over again if it's not working properly and you can go from there, guys.